I've seen it, sir. Oh. What for? What sort of question is that? Don't you see where you need to append your signature? Uh, yes, but sir, I don't think I can sign this document. Why not? There's so much typographical error here, you have to return to the secretary to redo it. Oh, really? Bring it. Please look through. I didn't observe that when I was uh, cross-checking. Mr. Chute, I can't find any typographical error in this document. They are all correct. Excuse me. <laughs> Sir. No. The total figure for the expenditure is 1,555,000 Naira. But what we have here is 3,555,000 Naira. <laughs> Mr. Jude, that, that's not an hero. It was intentionally added. For what, if I may ask? You are getting on my nerves. What is wrong with you, sir? Ha, you are the chief accountant of this company. Discharge your duties and let me report to the headquarters. Exactly what I'm saying. How do we explain the upsurge in the millions? The upsurge in the millions in the expenditure is for what? That's the question. Hmm. You see, Mr. Jude, that money you are talking about, I mean, that upsurge you're talking about, it's, um, <clears throat> it's an administrative lie, you know, a additional kind of argumental statistical it's all um, lies it's all lies i i'm i can i can't be a party to this that the figures are incorrect i'm sorry mr jude do you even know what you are saying i, ca I can't sign the figures are incorrect but what's your business with the figures I have an order from the Hindi that you sign this document so that they can revert to the reporters and you just have 24 hours i can't sign the document sir Mr. Jude, 24 hours. I can't sign it, sir. 24 hours. And what's the big deal about that? Is it not to just sign a document? Are you asking for money? Ha! Rachel! Mr. Jude, sign the document. That's what you are paid for. You were employed as an accountant to sign financial documents and collect salary. This is unbelievable. Are you suggesting that I sign falsified documents? See, Finish. The Bible says wisdom is profitable to direct. Exactly why God's wisdom is profitable to direct me not to sign falsified figures. Rachel, I believe you know how important your salary is to us in this family. Don't think you lose that job and bank on my own money, okay? Ah, <sighs> I will not commit this wickedness and sin against God. Ah, <sighs> even if it takes me to prison. I'm sure of making the throne at last. Yes. Jesus. Remember you just have less than 24 hours to think about it. Oh. Hey. What's your business with the figures? I have an order from the Hindi that you sign this document so that they can revert to the reporters. And you just have 24 hours. I can't sign the document, sir. Mr. Jude, 24 hours. I can't sign it, sir. Mr. Jude, sign the document. That's what you are paid for. You were employed as an accountant to sign financial documents and collect salary. This is unbelievable. Are you suggesting that I sign falsified documents? Remember, you just have less than 24 hours to think about it. Oh. If you lose this job, it is foolishness. 
Sometimes, as Christians, we need to take our eyes from some things. This thing we're talking about is everywhere. But dear, it's right there in the Bible. The Lord is sending us as sheep in the midst of wolves. We're not meant to become wolves like them. Don't you understand? Don't lose your job is all I'm saying. I would rather lose my job than lose heaven. He's talking about losing heaven here. Suit yourself. Just don't lose your job. This family needs the salary. Hello, good morning, Mr. Jude. Yeah, can you report to the office now? Yeah, thank you. Sir, you just called me. Yeah, good morning, Mr. Jude. Good morning. Have a seat. Thank you. For the nice work. Thank the MD just called to remind me about the document. Uh, he said he would be needing it in the next one half, as a needs to revert to the headquarters. What document? The document you were told to sign yesterday. Oh, that! Yes, that. Uh, I'm sorry, I wouldn't sign that document until the right figures are printed on it. Mr. Jude, are you all right? Are you trying to disobey the orders of the, the MD? Oh, uh, no, sir. The MD gave an order and you're trying to, you know, refuse. Oh, I'm sorry I can't sign it. I can't be a part to that, please. <laughs> you can report back to your office. Okay, sir. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay, sir. <laughs> what is this? <sighs> so you open wide your eyes and you lost your job. Is it not better than losing heaven? I hope you know there are a lot of bills to be paid in this family. And I hope you know as well that the Bible says a man who is not able to cater for his family is worse than an infidel. But Rachel, I have just been sacked today. Just today. You wait and see, and see if God is not going to come through for us. When? Hmm. Do you know how difficult it is to get a job now? Babe, babe, it, it may take long. It may not take long. But at least I've proven a point to this generation. I can't, I can't compromise. refused to sign the papers. I tried to convince him, but he refused. And you told him that I sent him to do that? Hmm. And that I will also need to revert to our head office in Germany? Of course I did. He blatantly refused. And so, a few minutes ago, I served him the sack letter as you directed, sir. And he took it without begging? Mr. Jude, who will he beg? That, I don't know. He, he immediately surrendered all the company's belongings and, and left, including the company's official car. What sort of a man is this, man? Stubborn. Too stubborn. I mean, had it been I mean, the capacity to sign that document, I would have done it fast. Is it not just to sign the document? What is there in signing the document that even we all will benefit from? At mm -hmm. least I'm also a parish pastor, so what's the big deal? Mm -hmm. 
Abby. What is it? I don't know. Just to sign uh, one paper. And when the money comes, all of us take you our share. You from the administrative cake. Ah, it is well. Good. Yeah. Hello, sir. Hello, Mr. Jude. Please, I'd like you to come to the office now. We need to talk. Sir? Uh, okay, sir. All right. You want to come and do what, sir? He, he has been sacked. This is for you. Sacked? Jesus Christ. Okay, what is it? All I've been doing is just a test. Following the instruction. We need we need a light on this one. Huh. Uh, to, to be truthful. Huh. And to say the truth, I may not be um, a devoted Christian. Huh. The CEO in Germany may not also be a devoted Christian, but this company needs a light. Someone who can be trustworthy and they're not one. Sir, I am light, sir. I am light. The Bible says that the light can shine in the darkness, and the darkness comprehended it not. Sir, I am light. I am only acting based on your instruction. I have to, I have to give honor to whom honor is due. It's what you said told us to do that we are doing, sir. I was, I was only acting based on instruction. You know, as my boss, we, we, are, we are to obey your instruction, sir. This, you, you have changed your face, sir. Sir, you are changing your face, sir. I was only acting according to instruction, sir. I am light. You compromised your faith. Ha! Huh? You compromised your stand. You compromised the standard. Ah, Oga, okay. it's not really so, sir. I was only after this on instruction, sir. Oga, okay, please. You are ashamed to Christian Dom. Mr. Oh. Mr. Jude, welcome. welcome. Mr. Jude, good You're day, welcome. sir. Thank you, sir. Mr. Jude, you called for me. Mr. Jude, I don't know, sir. Mr. Kafo, God bless you. Yes, you see, Mr. Jude, our company just opened a new branch in Canada. And uh, you have been promoted to the office of the director of the branch. Sir, I have just been sacked. I have the letter. Don't worry about that. Yes, congratulations. This is your letter. Congratulations, Mr. Jude. Are you joking? Unbelievable. Well, uh, Mr. Okafo, please, don't forget to leave all the company's documents and properties in your care to Mr. Jude. What happened, sir? He's sacked. He's no longer a staff member in this company. Ha! Jesus. We need light and we are one. Mr. Okafo, what happened? The result of compromise. Oh. I'm ashamed. I mean, yeah. I'm ashamed to Christian Dom. Well, well, Mr. Mr. Congratulations again. Thank you so much, sir. Please um, keep um, the light shining. Continue as a light that you are. No, I'm light. Too. <laughs> I'm light. I'm light too. I'm light too. Um, congratulations, sir. Uh, but to be a light, you have to unlearn some things. Compromise with consolidate. Corruption we cancel it. And all the things the world they are trying to do so that we don't overcome, we say no to everything coming from the world in Jesus' name. We will stand. We will hold fast. And this gospel, the pure gospel, the total gospel that the Lord has given us, we're going to keep until the final day in Jesus' name. 
I pray that the Lord will give every one of us, every one of you, the spirit of the conqueror. You'll be more than a conqueror. And every day the blessings of God will be multiplying in your life. 